Buy my shirt. Buy my shirt. Buy my hat. Buy, Buy it all. Hey everybody, what's up? If you're new to my channel, my name is Chris Clementor. If you're one of my Clementines, welcome back to the dysfunction that is my channel. If you think that I'm looking a little stuffed around the edges, it's because I've been drinking for a fucking month straight, it feels like. So, <sighs> I don't know where to start this adventure. I don't even fully know how to fucking describe this adventure. The other day, I was sitting on Twitter and I saw this video. I hope this music is copyright free because if my video gets taken down for a horse shit like this, I'm gonna be pissed. So that's what we're doing today. When I started watching this, I was like, oh, what a fun fucking stupid DIY for one of those jumbo phone cases that people get. You know the one? Some people have like a hot dog. Some people have like a Game Boy. Some people have a cry for help. I thought it was gonna be one of those cases. I saw somebody tweet that they thought it was gonna be a way to like hide your phone at the beach to prevent it from getting stolen. That makes a lot of sense. I didn't think that this would be to FaceTime somebody from the bottom of your foot. I figured I had to do this and see what was up. So I went and got flip flops, couldn't really find the beautiful yellow and hot pink, so I found gray because Honestly, that's kind of how I feel about this video. I have to say that there is something very humbling about um, putting your phone up to the bottom of a bunch of $4 flip-flops trying to find one that fits, so we've got size 13s in the house. I've taken my phone out of its case. I have the iPhone the giant one that costs a fucking life fortune. But that's the one I have, which made this 10 times harder to do. We're gonna see what this viral Twitter DIY video is up to because I just really think it should be stopped. Just Twitter in general. <laughs> I'm gonna put one of these aside because I don't see this going perfectly. Shocker, I know. While I'm tracing this, I feel like this would be a great time to address my inconsistent uploading. I have been traveling, and that means, you know what, I'm not uploading that often. But when I am back in LA, it is over for you all because it's back to two videos a week, which reminds me, Siri, call my therapist. So I've done what I foresee being the easiest part of this video, and I've traced my phone on the bottom of a flip-flop, which... Jesus Christ. We're going from the easiest part of this video to, I'm assuming, the hardest part, and that is cutting this shape out without cutting the whole flip-flop off. Because you want to be able to FaceTime your friends without fully showing you have a hole in your shoe. I still can't believe that that was the fucking purpose of this. I really cannot believe that a group of adults put that video together and then hired two people to be in it. Mom, do we have any, like, really strong X-Acto knives? <gasps> Sorry, it had to hit the ground or it was going through my hand. Oh, here we go. We are... Oh shit, did I just cut the room? I really know I shouldn't be sweating from this, but I am. Oh my god, I am sweating so much. Yeah, this shit really does look easier when it's fucking hyperlapsed. I've got to be real. I don't think this shit looked easy to begin with because they took a fucking melon baller to get the foam out of the bottom of the shoe, but... Hey, they're the experts. I'm no Twitter, hyperlapse, DIY, oversaturated kind of bitch, so... This next part, scooping out flip-flop foam with a melon baller, I think is... Yep. We all, I think, are on the same page of agreeance on this one. Agreement? Agreeance? Who gives a fuck? So in the video, the... Okay, so... This is some fucking crackhead shit, okay? This is about to turn into just the ugliest rant that anybody has seen. This is bullshit. This, oh God, I'm just so annoyed that I fucking chose to do this. I'm gonna score this a little bit more to hopefully make this job a little easier. All right, still haven't cut through the shoe. Honestly, a miracle. Ooh, <gasps> guys. I don't know why I'm getting so excited that this could be working because it's still the stupidest fucking thing I've ever seen. We have our first chunk, which is what I say every morning as I sit on the toilet to crank it out. Never mind. yeah, you guys know. Now that I'm finally in the same house as my mom, I thought we would do a fun check-in. Yep, mom's still my job, she can hear me. What's happening? What's happening? Um, well, here we go. Um, I'm melon balling foam from a Walgreens flip-flop. How's that working for you? How's it working for me? How do you think it's working for me, mom? I don't know, the video is awful simple. 
the video? They are fucking frauds on that video. I mean, truly, at this point, I would just rather FaceTime nobody ever again if this was my only fucking option. I'd rather buy the new iPhone and just glue it to the bottom of my shoe. Can I come see how it looks without being on camera? Yeah, mom, you can completely come and see how it looks right now. Just Google gray flip flop. Oh my God, I hate this. Fuck the internet. Oh my God, I wish I could bend these scissors sideways so I could just go like, oh wait, I'm kind of, making moves with this. I've been filming for 21 minutes since the intro. This is literally how much fucking progress I've made. Oh my god, fuck you, hyperlapse video. God, I don't recommend anyone doing this, but if you are stupid enough like me to do it. A paint can opener. That's stop from going up the fucking stairs. I think a dinosaur came into your video while I was on. A video. dinosaur came into your video? Yeah. Did you do it? <laughs> if anybody <laughs> wants to know where I get it, it's from my mama. Oh. I think a, Chris, I don't want to alarm you. I think a, I think a dinosaur crossed the stage. Oh god. This is just insanity. I've built like four-story crocs before. I've made the fucking Balenciagas that look like socks. And the hardest thing I'm having trouble with is this. On the day that I'm filming this, tomorrow is my little brother's birthday, his 21st. And I'm gonna take the bottle that I got for him and pop it and chug it immediately upon hitting stop recording. Sorry, little bro. Some of us need it more. The table's like, please free me! I would definitely say that this DIY requires a friend, not for them to actually do anything, but just for emotional support. So I'm going in with scissors now after doing the paint can opener, I've tried the melon baller. This is just like really a full house operation and I'm not talking about trying to get me into USC. Look at this though. We're almost, we're on, on the road to FaceTiming. I don't want to get anyone's hopes up, but I'm almost fucking done. So I've cut it all out. It honestly looks like the surface of the moon after Lance Armstrong had his way with it. Neil Armstrong, Neil Armstrong, Neil Armstrong rode a rocket. Lance Armstrong rode a bike. Oh, and then Louis Armstrong was the saxophone. He rode the trumpet. Stay in school, kids. Stay in school. Okay, the only reason that that's important to know is when you're trying to make a reference hollowing out a fucking $4 flip flop. Or impress somebody in a bar. You know. I mean, if I'm at a bar, I'm not there to impress anybody, Mom. Are we having fun yet? Because my answer's no. Oh no! We have broken skin on the flip flop. All right, so. I mean, this just doesn't fucking stay in. Even if this was used for a way to prevent your phone from getting stolen at the beach, I'd rather just have my phone stolen. Waiting in the Apple store isn't even this bad. Just cut another, <coughs> oh, whoa. Apparently smoked a pack of cigarettes. Just cut another hole into the flip flop. Just don't let it be on the table. Mom, your table is fine, okay? I think what we really have to worry about is my mental health after this one. Alright, so this was a nice glimpse of what living at home would be like at 25. So I've hollowed out a majority of this and I've literally done everything the video said. I have, I mean, just moon rock coming out of my asshole at this point. So I figured, let's put it to the test, see if it fucking works. Oh. Hey, how are you? Oh my god, thank god I was wearing my flip flops in bed. Hold on, I'm almost in... Hold on, I'm almost in frame. Hey, can you see me? Hold on, I'm almost... Hey, how are you? So good to see you again. I'm fucking out of breath. Oh. Hey, oh hey boss, what's up? I'm fired? Can I ask why? Oh, wasn't working hard enough, got it, okay. Well, I'm on a jog right now. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and be by a pack later to clear my desk. Sound good? All right, sounds good, okay. 
Yeah, it's so fucking crazy. Hold on, I have to... Hold on, sorry, my phone fell out of my flip... Oh, sorry. Just fell out again. Hold on. Let me just make sure it's in between my toes. <laughs> okay, hold on, you still there? Are you still... Oh, fuck. Hold on. Oh, anyway, just wanted to let you know. Grandma's dead. <laughs>